Hi, I'm Kim Taylor Bennett in Paris for Women's Fashion Week. I'm going to be catching up with Samsung Mobile, plus I'll be having a play around with the new Samsung Galaxy S5 and finding out what the deal is with their smart wearable devices. So right now we're heading to the Samsung showroom where hopefully they're going to let me borrow the new Galaxy S5. There's a bunch of new camera features and I'm really excited to hit the streets. And I'm going to be speaking with some of Fashion's Elite to really find out what they think about this new relationship between tech and fashion and where things are moving in the future. Hi, I'm Kim. <laughs> nice to meet you. So you're the guy who's going to tell me everything about the new devices. Absolutely. So as you can see, this is the Galaxy S5 and some wearable devices uh, called the Gear 2 and the Gear Fit. So what we're going to do, just take this device here, tap on the camera. Now what this does, we can see a 0.3 second autofocus. Now that's the fastest in any smartphone across the world. We've got a, a, what's called HDR, do you know what that means? I don't. No, that means high dynamic range. It makes it nice and bright. What you can also do is a selective focus. If we tap on far focus, it will then blur out the foreground and actually show you the background. That's crazy. And it's water resistant. We've got a fingerprint scanner at the bottom, so we're just gonna use my finger and it'll unlock. Now you can use that with PayPal as well. So we've got the Gear 2 and the Gear Fit. This is the first wearable device that's actually curved. You can swipe along and you get your heart rate monitor. It'll actually give you an exercise friend as well. And this will track it and link in with S Health on the devices. On the Gear 2, we've got a camera on these devices, which is just at the top. Now it does 15 seconds of uh, video recording. And as soon as you've taken that image or video, it will transfer straight away onto your device. I realize how important is this technology in fashion. Okay. I think before fashion was just creative and technology was on the other side and now I think they really work very well together. What I want is very new for me. I want to use the power of the, I will say, the, the technology to make something different. I think this is for me genius. First of all, it's bigger, so I can see much better. It's quicker, everything is quicker. It's not complicated, it's just much better. Can I take a picture of you guys right here? Yes, yeah, you guys are posing well. You're posing well. In terms of like fashion and technology, do you think that one is kind of fueling the other and pushing things forward? I mean, I think definitely fashion has been um, reimagined by technology. Internet is like the most, the most important. Yeah. How important is having a good camera on your phone? Very important. Yeah. Otherwise, I wouldn't. I would get another one. This is uh, everything. Cool. So it's like super duper fast. It's amazing. Like, yeah, it's good. This, okay. This, this, yeah. Picture no. Immediately, it's the quality is so incredible, but I like it. You know, I'm a dreamer and I like to see fashion as a dream and I see with this technology, you can be more and more a dreamer, you know, that's what I like. So that's the end of Paris Fashion Week 2014. I got to try out the new Samsung Galaxy S5 and learn a little bit more about their wearable technology. And I spoke with fashion legend Karine Rutfeld. It's been amazing to see how fashion and technology are really working hand in hand these days. I can't wait to see what's up next.